Off-duty pilot Joseph David Emerson, accused of trying to shut off the engine of an Alaska Airlines flight, expected in court today, facing 167 charges, including 83 counts of attempted murder. According to a federal criminal complaint, 44-year-old Emerson told investigators he hadn't slept in 40 hours, felt like he was having a nervous breakdown, and mentioned to them the use of psychedelic mushrooms. Authorities say the off-duty pilot attempted to pull the T-handles while sitting in the jump seat inside the cockpit of the flight. The on-duty Alaska Airlines pilots say they did not see anything wrong with Emerson until he allegedly said, I'm not okay, and then reached up to grab the red fire extinguisher handles and pull them down. A struggle immediately ensued and Emerson was taken down and removed from the cockpit. According to the complaint, he reportedly asked a flight attendant to cuff him. No fight, no commotion, um, just nervous passengers, but quietly nervous. One of the 80 passengers on board the flight that was scheduled to land in San Francisco from Everett, Washington, says she was panicked. So we landed and then about 10 police officers armed came on, um, walked straight to the back of the plane where I was sitting and detained him. Then the flight attendant got back on and told us he had a mental breakdown. The flight making an emergency landing in Portland, Oregon, where the off-duty pilot was arrested. Emerson was scheduled to be part of the flight crew on an upcoming Alaska Air 737 flight departing from San Francisco before his arrest. Emerson was sitting in the cockpit jump seat behind the pilot and first officer. Had that handle been shut off, it would have killed the fuel to the engine mid-flight. Aviation experts say that move could have been fatal. A preliminary review of Emerson's work history shows a clean service record. The FBI says they're investigating whether he was on a psychedelic trip, dealing with the mental health crisis, or something else. Melissa Adon, ABC News, Los Angeles.